If you're a sports fan, chances are you have seen the artwork of James Fiorentino. He is a New Jersey artist whose portraits of iconic players, especially baseball legends, are popular with art collectors and athletes alike. If I make a mistake here with the black, you're done. <laughs> James Fiorentino's love of baseball may not have led to a career in the majors, but the watercolors that he paints of baseball legends are in a league of their own. And the reason why I became famous for the sports art is because I love it. I love the play, I love to watch it, I enjoy everything about it. I play it myself, I feel like I understand what these guys go through. There's so much involved in it. Fiorentino has painted icons from Babe Ruth to Derek Jeter, Sparky Lyle to Cal Ripken and Tony Gwynn. His art hangs in private collections, galleries and museums. I just think there's something so um, interesting about seeing it in black and white, more realistic maybe. The portrait that he's working on here is of one of his favorite players, Hall of Fame right fielder Hank Aaron. He was the all-time home run hit leader and uh, of course doing it as a, as a black man and, and beating Babe Ruth's record. Fiorentino's passion for baseball and his talent for art go back to his very beginnings. I remember going to the local New Jersey Art in the Park shows, setting up and having um, paintings of these players along with floral paintings, flowers, landscapes, and animals. And, and I remember the judges, I always say this, the judges would say, wow, we love his landscapes and these these flower paintings, and he should stick with that. Don't do the sports stuff. But I remember going to my mom and dad saying, I love doing the sports stuff. I want to keep doing it. When he was just 15, the Baseball Hall of Fame purchased a painting. And soon, players and fans alike wanted to own a Fiorentino portrait. He's been a full-time artist ever since, working at his New Jersey studio painting baseball players and athletes of all sports. But Fiorentino is also getting back to his roots. Creating the kind of wildlife paintings that those art in the park judges had told him to stick to when he was just a kid. I hate when people say, oh, you're a sports artist. I'm not a sports artist, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an artist. I'm an illustrator, I'm a painter. You know, I'm, I happen to paint all my stuff in watercolor, but I love to paint anything I feel. An artist pursuing two of his passions and hitting a home run.